first off, a series sweep on the weekend for you at BCU. Take all your dreams from the four and two NCAA play. First off, how's, how good does that feel? It feels great, you know, coming into the weekend. You know, we knew BCU would be a tough opponent. They've been playing real well coming in two and one. And, you know, a big win over um, East Carolina, the 25th ranked team in the country, 18 11 on Tuesday. And, you know, we knew we were in tough battle. We got a good start on Friday and swung the bat really well. And, um, you know, just played well the whole weekend. And, you know, I thought every game we outplayed them and, and were very deserving of what we got. We got, we got. Two. We got two. Now, Coach, you got a pretty good start out of Dave Jesh here today going another six innings for you guys. Really seems to continue to be stepping up for uh, for your team. What did you see from him that made him so effective in, the, in this game? You know, Dave has, you know, just such quiet confidence. And he has a belief that you think he was a three-year starter or a senior, the way he throws on the mound with his off-speed stuff. And, you know, just the way he approaches hitters and he fears nothing and, you know, as good a stuff as he has, it's, I think it's his courage and, you know, a little bit, um, I guess, gullible, you know, and, and not knowing the big situations that he's in and he's just making great pitches and, and giving us continual good starts. Now, Coach, you get out of two bases loaded situations with two inning-ending double plays, first from Joe Berg, then from Cody Norman, really allowed you guys to build some, uh, some momentum there. How big was it from uh, from those two guys to come in and get the uh, get those plays? You know they've been our guys all year and, and the ones we really counted on. And um, you know they were big yesterday. They had a nice inning. Cody struck out uh, Colin in, in yesterday's game, and Joe had three solid innings yesterday and went right back to him. And, and Joe got a huge double play. And, and and you know Cody walked the guy to to get the go ahead run, but then he answered back with the double play ball. And you know then we were. Uh, we were able to get the win and, and play behind him. I, you know, I have a lot of confidence in Kobe and Joe and, and the rest of the bullpen. Now, Coach, you explode for eight runs in the bottom of the eighth inning. That was after a bit of a contentious play at second base where Austin Diamond gets taken out on a double play ball. What, what did you say to your team in the, in the dugout in between innings in, in terms of did they already know that we're going to use this as a little bit of extra fire motivation going forward? Definitely. You know, I, I thought, um, you know, VCU attacked us all weekend and not so much offensively, just – you know, in mind and, and, and the way they talked and the way they acted. And, you know, um, you know, definitely Austin got taken out on a rough play there at second. He got called uh, for defensive interference, so he got the he got the out. And, you know, I thought our guys really did a good job of answering the bell. You know, the three-run homer from Hammer on the, you know, first and second no outs and a 3-2 count. And then TJ coming back with another two-run homer. And, listen, I, I – I've been seeing this for the, the whole season of the, the, the comebacks and the not quitting and the effort and the team unity. And we've got a lot of good things going on right now, and I'm real happy. Now, Coach, obviously. In the